we'll design a board game. We're going to train Video Game Nerd Man again. Uh, programming course. Bam. See if we can't increase his technology up to 500. Diamond Die has ra racked over 500k in sales. Fantastic. So, we're actually getting some money now. Some money. Uh, I just smacked the uh, mic as well. I don't know if you heard that. So let's have a look. See, we are we've we've now made a profit uh, on paper, but technically we haven't, which I guess is the worst. So, well, okay. The the Nintendo New has been released. Uh, 96k straight into the bank account. That's putting a nice big dent in uh, in everything. And um, yeah, we're gonna train some people again. Clinton, congratulations. You're you're gonna teach a uh, project product management or R&D. R&D gives us extra research or or we could do a game design course. Uh, I think we're going to go with the programming course because Clinton seems to be kind of where we're going with that. Uh, we're going to come over to here. We're going to train? No. Sorry. Uh, that was the wrong menu altogether. We're going to train and we're going to send her uh, on a teach and learn game design course game design let's get the let's get the design up a bit and a no we're going to train him we're going to give him uh programming again uh eli lewis we're going to train and because at the moment i want to focus on making our people the best that they can be uh because if they're if they're good then yeah we'll, we'll make better games and better games means mo money mo money mo money which of course is our motto here at Video Game Nerd Team. Mo money, mo money, mo money. It's the best motto. Uh, we can already give this guy uh, the boost and the design specialization. So we're going to give this guy the boost. Uh, we're not going to give this guy the boost, apparently, uh, because I don't have enough research points for either of those. So I'll just say well played to myself for completely missing that. Uh, the G3, G3 Innovation Challenge... Uh, or no, we'll give him the... Where's the Pixel Cup? Pixel Cup, here we go. Get to it. Everyone else is taking an official course except for you. You're on a Pixel Cup because we can't afford to actually teach you anything. But you're pretty good already, so it doesn't matter. There's a clear trend towards RPG games recently. Well, that's fantastic. Once everyone's stopped, we'll make another RPG game. Uh, we'll get our research points. We'll get a couple of boosts in here for Video Game Nerd Man and for... Uh, and for Rich, because I know Rich, uh, he's feeling he's feeling sassy, and uh, he wants this boost. So uh, he's a bit tired. Pixel Cup apparently took a lot out of him, because uh, you know he's just terrible. But it, it could be worse, you know. I've seen I've seen people get tired after less. Uh, an employee of the Environmental Protection Agency ever, and they have an offer for me. The company has a high electrical footprint right now. If you would install solar panels, you could decrease your footprint and save money in the long run. You would sponsor 50% of the cost, which brings your investment down to 200k. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Nice, let's do it. Solar collector. Here we go, solar panels. Let's decrease the amount of money it costs per per uh, week to or month even to run this place. Because Oh no, it is week, it's weekly we do this. Okay, come on, Elizabeth. Hurry up with your course, Jesus. Uh, Diamond Eyes now off the market. Uh, oh, wow. We made 12 million in profit, did we? Hang on. Game history. No, no, no. We made 12 million in income, but we only made a profit of 5.7 million. So this is not bad. It's not bad. We, there, there have been worse, uh, worse games released, like Finally Fantasy. I don't know what we were doing with that. That was terrible. Um, we gained twenty six thousand fans, but again, it wasn't it wasn't the best game. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do a follow on though. I'm feeling it. Oh, recently installed solar panels in their offices. While well, the off, uh, video games and soft, uh, software industries are one of the cleanest industries on earth, they do eat up a lot of electricity. Oh uh, yeah, here we go. Yeah, industry news. We're making news right now. That's how we roll. Twenty four seven. Yo, uh, okay, we're yeah, we're gonna develop a sequel. No, you know, what? let's find a publisher. Let's let's give someone else the chance to to make money off of us. Any topic, any genre, any platform, and uh, and it's got to score a minimum of five, and it's just got to be game large. Fantastic, that's exactly what we want. So, topic. Uh, 
I don't know. It's it's an RPG, and I'm feeling like I'm feeling like post-apocalyptic, post-apocalyptic RPG. Large. It's going to be mature. It's going to be called um, Falling Out uh, Three. Uh, even though that we haven't done a first one, uh, it's Falling Out Three. Uh, and it's going to be on the Mbox 360, considering we've got it and it's got quite a bit of market share. It's a shame that we can't do it for multiple platforms, actually. Why can't we release a game for, for many platforms and just make lots and lots of money, like real companies do, you know? But, you know, you, you gotta, you gotta, you got to play to within the boundaries of the game, I guess. So, we'll start development. It's a 2D graphics V3, yet again. We're feeling the 2D graphics. The 2D graphics are where it's at. You know, without 2D graphics, who who cares? Okay, it's it's an RPG, so quests and stories, bam, maximum. Uh, engine, uh, we're going to take multiplayer out. It's not a multiplayer game. It does have mod support, though. I'm feeling the mod support, and we'll increase that to their gameplay. What do we need for gameplay? We don't need a mouse, uh, and in fact, we don't need a joystick, uh, so we can take the gameplay down just a bit. Uh, stories and quests. We want a linear story. I oh, know. We want a branching story and advanced cutscenes. Here we go. Oh yeah, I'm feeling it. Bam. Let's do this. It's gonna be good. We're we're gonna rack in all the points, all the heavy points. Look, video game nerd man, dropping the big seven bomb right there into the technology scale. Vony has announced the successor to the massively successful Play System 2, the new console predictably called Play System 3. Yeah, come on, Vony, think up of a new name, will ya, mug? And comes with an impressive hardware configuration. Ooh, crazy. Uh, the console also doubles as a player for Blu ray, which uh, Vony hopes will become the successor to the DVD format. Uh, spoiler alert, it does. Uh, we will see how customers react to it. Fair enough. To be fair though, Blu-ray, I'm talking about real life right now, is already on its way out because everything is going digital now uh, and there's nothing that they can really do about it. You know, everything's going digital uh, and that's about it. It's it's over, I think. Uh, dialogues, maximum. We want maximum dialogues for this game. And in fact, you know what? That looks about right. That literally does look right. So bang, there we go. Bob's your uncle. Job done. Um... Yeah, Blu-ray, it's it's on its way out. In fact, any physical media is pretty much on its way out right now because everything is a digital download nowadays. And personally, I'm all for it. You know, I, I, I don't like having stacks and stacks and stacks of uh, cases for... Uh, you know what? Let's increase the world design ever so slightly. Decrease sound, decrease graphics. Uh, Eli and Elizabeth are massively overworked. Richard... Oh, God. No. Oh, God, no. Uh, oh god, why? Clinton. Okay. I get Clinton on world design. Uh, he's not got a great design, but he's got a decent enough design. He's got pretty good tech as well. Uh, oh god. I think we need to get... We need more designers, actually, is what we really need. Uh, we, we want a virtual economy, obviously. Uh, Elizabeth is massively overworked. So, we'll decrease this down to about there we'll decrease this down to about there and then Elizabeth will decrease yet again and then him yet again and then him yet again there we go right uh, we got Clinton on des well designed but that's literally because we can't really do anything else sound we don't have enough to do stereo sound and a soundtrack uh, so I don't know I think uh, I think we do kind of need to increase it ever so slightly. Come on, come on. Like that. Although now uh, Elizabeth is overworked. Uh, it's you, You're going to have to put up and shut up. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, there we go. That works much better. Uh, I'll get Video Game Nerd Man to work it. And then if I decrease it ever so slightly, come on. Oh, look at that. I'm playing this. Oh, no. Wait. Oh. 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 No. Oh, why? I'm trying to play the system right now. Come on. Come on, please. Oh, God, no. I can't. Oh, blizzard. Okay, it's fine. Sound is going to be at 99%, uh, whereas Video Game Node Man is going to be at 100%. So, and, but it does free up Elizabeth. Uh, so we could get Elizabeth 
in on the what? No, we can't. Uh, <laughs> we'll leave it to Clinton. Clinton knows what he's doing. He's a cool guy. He doesn't afraid of anything. Let's do this. Come on. Let's hope that this works. Richard and Eli are both absolutely knackered as well. They are both deserving of a holiday. In fact, from the looks of it, everyone is. Everyone is tired. They're fed up. They don't want to work at this company anymore. I'm getting resignation letters daily. Oh my god, it's crazy. There's only six people here and I've got like 12 resignation letters. How did this happen? Oh god, so now we're just we're adding a little bit more to it and then we're going to finish up. Uh, oh my god, they are adding quite a bit more. Uh, oh, adding just a tiny bit more. Can't sort out that bug. There we go. Finish. There we go. It's not the highest that we've ever gotten. It's a trend match and it's good management though, which is another 1.5 bonus to leveling up. And that's what we want to do. We're, we're all about the leveling up here. This might not be a great selling game. Uh, but it's kind of a filler game between amazing games because you can't have every game that you make can't be a bestseller. If it is, then that becomes the norm and then it's no longer a bestseller. You know, you, you're no longer you're no longer creating best hits. You're just creating games. And then it'll, people will start asking, well, when are they going to create another best hit? You know, it's, it's going to get to that sort of point. No loading screens. That is something that should have been in this game, but it wasn't normalized again okay well we got that just in time we're gonna create a large booth uh we got the money too uh and what some calling bizarre show of arrogance of only representatives have been trash talking micronoft wow that trash talk Vony, you need to chill out son please the mbox and the Vony are both good good pieces of of software please and hardware please don't fight each other there's nothing, there's nothing to fight about. Oh. We're not so sure they'll want it so badly as so far, the Vony 3, the PlaySystem 3 has no games. Wow, can you believe it? 